Percy was going about his duties. Over the bridge. Wow! What happened there? said Percy. Where did the track go? Thomas arrived. What happened to you, Percy? he said. Uh, there's no track on the bridge, said Percy, rather embarrassed. I'll go and get some help, said Thomas. That's strange, thought Thomas. What happened to the track? Chompa arrived and eventually got Percy back on the rails. Percy thanked Chompa, who then started putting the bridge back together. Later on, James was travelling out in the country. Turn the corner and... Ouch! said James. What happened? Where did the track go? Thomas came by. Oh no, not you as well, James. I'll go and get help. Something strange was going on and Thomas was going to find out what. Chompa arrived. He heaved James back on the track. James thanked Chompa and left. Chompa started repairing the track. Meanwhile, Thomas was trying to work out what was going on. He passed the tunnel to the woods. Wait a minute. That's the naughty Tom Moss the Prank Engine. I might have known. And look, you have the three bits of missing track. Three? There's only been two accidents. Meanwhile, Gordon was pulling the express through the country. It was his favourite job. Then he turned a bend and... Ow! Where did the track go? Luckily for the passengers in the express coach, they stayed on the track. It was just Gordon on the grass. Thomas came by. Not you as well, Gordon. I'll go and get some help. Thomas left, but as he turned the corner, he caught a glimpse of Tom Moss in the tunnel. He stopped and came back. Tom Moss realised he'd been seen, but Thomas didn't chase him. Instead, he steamed off in the opposite direction. Tom was relieved, but Thomas had a plan. He met Chomper and told him about Gordon, but wanted him to do something first. Chomper went over to the track that led to Tom Moss and his tunnel. He then did what Tom Moss had been doing all day and took a section of track out. He took it over to Gordon. Tom Moss was now stuck. He couldn't come up his line to cause any more accidents. Thomas and Chomper helped Gordon. They were pleased with their work. Tom Moss also realised that while he couldn't get to the other engines, they couldn't get to him either. Thanks for watching our story. Here's another one you may have missed. <laughs>